shirts are now available. Pick it up in the description box, man. Thank y'all for tuning in to the channel. What's good, what's good, what's good, what's good, family? What's good? You know what I mean? Don't forget to go to this uh the description, man. We got some great treats down there for you, man. You want to get your drip shirts, be there, Charlie Joints or the never um no negative energy shirts, they write in the description box. We got more stuff at the store too. You we'll come check out and we got the book out, right? We got the book out right now. You know what I'm saying? We got all this stuff in the description box. Come check it out, man. If you ain't subscribed to the channel, subscribe to the channel, hit that like button, man, and just support us, man. You know what I mean? But anyway, man, let's talk about it, man. Kanye West, man. Supposed to be getting a divorce and all of this, like shit going all over the world. What do I think about it? I think it's bull. I think it's BS, man. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel 100% because I feel like this, man. Uh, out of all the people that we seen Kim with, she divorced them instantly. She ain't divorced Kanye yet. You know what I'm saying? Because he kind of fit into the mold of what they do. You know what I mean? It's like uh, all the stuff he be doing, the antics and stuff like that. I'm like, I, I don't, at this point, I'm like confused. Like he got, I was watching the Breakfast Club joint. He got DJ Envy so goddamn old man. He said he don't even want to hear the album. <laughs> I don't, I just don't, I don't understand why they, why is he taking these tactics to um, degrade our culture, man. I see a lot of people that do that, man. I be sitting back like, why is it that there's all these black people degrading our culture like they doing, man? You know what I'm saying? They'll say like rap music and shit like that. I'm talking about people that got, they very intelligent people, but they, they just be saying a lot of ignorant ass shit. You know what I mean? Like real dumb ass shit. Like Kanye just was coming out, man. I'm like, I'm looking at this. <laughs> I'm like, this dude right here, I don't know what the fuck going on. Everybody say it's album time, so he doing all these antics and shit like that. Now he bipolar. I'm like, why we never hear this shit when the album not coming out? We don't hear no bipolar shit and all these answers next thing you know he riding on the horse in the church i'm like this shit be getting wild but i'm like yay uh, like dog like this shit is crazy man you know what i mean i can't i can't vibe on that energy though like i don't understand what a nigga doing out here you know what i'm saying i seen rizza islam and everybody coming at all uh, all uh, yay net for that hair but me um statements and shit like that you know what i mean i'm like i i, I just don't see her divorcing them even though I, I be feeling like a lot of this shit just be antics, man. Hollywood shit, you know what I mean? A bunch of stunts and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I'm like, this, I don't know, this, is this a bad look, you know what I mean, for me? And the Kanye thing, and I seen, what, what was it, Lil Baby said he, he missed out on working with Kanye. I mean, I, no disrespect, man, but at this point, I could never work with Kanye. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If I was an artist, man, I, I just be feel like he be doing a lot of shit that just is, is degrading the culture man and then he don't apologize for the shit he just be doing it and don't even be giving a fuck you know what i mean i don't be understanding that type of thinking like that you know what i mean that shit is like it's weird and wild to me you know what I mean? but like i say some people only care about fame and connection you know what i mean like so they don't give a fuck you know what i mean they'll just keep working with the nigga you know <laughs> well yeah you gonna, gonna send me a million records and then let me go work with him like i can't I mean, you gotta have principle, man. I feel like he's he's violating our culture in a bad way. You know what I mean? I just think he need to just stop it, man. You know what I mean? Apologize to everybody and just. I mean, I, I get you, you, you allegedly got mental illness and stuff like that, but when you recover, you gotta apologize, man. You are hurting a lot of people with the stuff you're doing, man. Shit is very hurtful, man. And very disrespectful to the culture, man. Especially with a lot of people that look up to him and are inspired by. His past work, not not his recent shit that he's doing right now. And his antics is like it's crucifying the, the, the uh, a true Kanye fan. You know what I mean? Like niggas can't look at him the same. You know what I mean? They like, oh, what the fuck is this dude? Like, who is this guy? You know what I mean? Like, like I say, that shit is like I don't know. I don't know what's up going on with bro. Like, I, I went from a person that was like he can rap to like listening to his shit. Like, oh, he he, he dope. So now I'm, I'm saying all these antics and shit like that. I don't even. I'm like, I'm, I'm, I'm with DJ Envy. I don't even want to hear this shit at this point, at all. I don't want to hear none of this shit at this point. You know what I mean? <laughs> I just feel like he just be violating it. He violating shit, man. When he doing what he doing, man. Then he not apologizing. He running around with Donald Trump hats on, and I'm like, yo, like enough is enough, bro. Enough is enough. You know what I mean, going too far with it. You know what I mean, like. So many people standing behind Kanye for him to uh, act the way he acted, man. You know what I mean? Like, that shit is, uh, it's not cool at all, man. 
You know what I mean? Especially like just playing with the culture like that, bro. Like the history of the culture and all of that. It's like, bro, stop it, bro. Like, <laughs> seriously, man. But like I said, that divorce shit, fool, man. Nah. And then they, they were talking about Meat Mill. <laughs> he said Meat Mill hit uh, Kemp. That Meat said that shit fraudulent. That's all cap. <laughs> You know, if, you know when a man come out and say it's all cap, you know it's cap. You know what I mean? That's like I was telling niggas, Shadi ain't never hit um, Sakashi baby mama. That shit was all cap too. Sakashi just was using that because he, because of the snitching thing, he didn't want to be the bad guy. You know what I'm saying? But like I say, uh, being a snitch is, is, is a bad guy. Period. You know what I mean? No matter what the scenario was, and it wasn't. First of all, they wasn't stealing his money. That was a lie. That um, six nine said and. Nobody fucked this baby mama. That was a lie too. All the shit he said was a lie. He just was trying to get out of what he was into. Now, the Kim Kardashian shit, she would have left this nigga a long time ago. If that was the case. She yeah, she's not leaving Kanye, man. I don't believe this shit. I just don't believe this shit. You know what I mean? Maybe y'all believe it. I just don't believe it. <laughs> I mean, all the niggas she was with that was big time niggas from the Reggie Bushes, baseball players, all these niggas she married and, and left. And, and now Ye, she would have been dead already. I just don't see it happening, man any form of fashion I think is it's all publicity and a bunch of uh games and shit niggas playing with niggas and I feel like it's a foul game because it's like people got respect for them you know what I mean a lot of people got respect for them and honor for them I just feel like this type of game ain't funny man like, this type of shit is hella disrespectful man like, hella disrespectful man I can't even like I, I don't get it at this point at all I'm confused as a motherfucker you know what I mean shit is crazy man when I'm out, man. I love y'all. Peace, God. Trench talk. Where you can't trust nobody but your black guy. Where niggas getting booked for murder. Got niggas doing numbers like equations. Trench talk. When you jump up off the porch as a youngin' and start posting on the block with the junkies and get it bouncing like a motherfucking bungee. Trench talk. Trench talk, trench talk, yeah. Trench talk, trench talk, trench talk, trench talk, yeah. Yeah, I was locked behind that wall, but I ain't proud about it.